Sup, bitches. This is Master Rainy. This video is a rant on pathetic shit that motherfucking pisses me off. Telemarketing for the exact bunch of fucking retards. Why won't those motherfucking pieces of shit just fuck off? Sorry about that. I'm just gonna continue with this. Telemarketing has been around since the late 70s, and to which that has been going around for 40 fucking years, approximately. And this stupid piece of shit is still happening today, in 2017. Now allow me to demonstrate how those low-life retards caused this bad shit to happen by explicitly showing you the scenarios. Hello? Why, hello? So what you calling me for? Um, I'm just calling for some cool ass headlights for your SUV. I don't have an SUV. Another option is for those radio gadgets for your SUV as well. I already told you! I don't have an SUV, you piece of shit! Now do me a favor and fuck off! I have to keep telling you, they're a bunch of fucking liars. And now for the most part, they will shove junk in your face via email. You've got mail. Would you please stop tinkering with my blue screen of death? What? An email telling me that I have a payment to make on Netflix? I don't even have a Netflix account. How can I make a payment on Netflix if I don't have an account? Seems to be falsification to be a part of their crappy imaginable to-do list. Whatever shit they do is fraudulent. Question is, how is telemarketing legal? A scenario of all telemarketers being arrested and incarcerated shall exist. Simply for telemarketing. But does it really exist? No, because it's just my dream and my imagination. Telemarketing can be persistent too. Hello? Hello! This is your landlord speaking to you! I'm just giving you a note that you are seven days behind your monthly rent! Will you just stop calling me, you piece of shit? This is already the fifth time and I know it, you drooling mouth! I don't even live in an apartment! I don't have a landlord! And no, I am not behind in any of my rents, you asshole! See that? The telemarketer in the scenario posing as a landlord making a phone call to his own tenant. The receiver of the call says it has been the fifth time the same telemarketer called after being told to stop. Telemarketers are truly and ultimately retarded. They are ultimately retarded floxinocinahilipilifications. They sit on their lazy fat asses mysteriously calling people sending junk mail, all that shit that must be illegalized. Imagine so. If telemarketing was illegalized, would the telemarketers be detained right away? Hell no. That's called an ex post facto law. Telemarketing businesses would just close just so those retarded low-life dimwits are forced to find more legitimate jobs. An inconvenient way to stop telemarketing from happening is attempting to block every telemarketing phone number. The convenient way is to go to the national do not call registry under do not call .gov if you haven't registered. Then you click on register a phone number and follow the three steps. Before the third step is complete, they'll shoot an email to the email address that you put in for the first step with the link that works once. 
and you'll have to respond to it by clicking the link. Under the link, the page tells you that you have your phone number registered. Well, later, bitches. That's all I gotta say. Leave me a like if you think that telemarketing should be illegalized. And leave me a dislike if you think that telemarketing is extremely necessary. Goodbye, y'all.